Hey guys, what's up? It's Sarah and today I have a very exciting video for you. I'm sure you can tell by the title pretty much what this is going to be, but I figured I'd explain it a little bit before we jump right in. So this was an idea that I had a couple weeks ago. I was laying in bed and this just randomly popped into my brain and I was like, that would be so much fun. So what I did today is I had my dad come into my room I had him pick out an outfit for me. I didn't tell him why. I just said, okay, pick out my outfit. And he did. He went through all of my clothes and he was like, this is the one I like the most. Okay. So what I want you to do is I want you to go through my closet, this. I mean, if you want, you can do like these top two drawers because these have shirts in it, jeans, and then like pants. And I want you to pick out an outfit. What? That's just evil. You want me to pick out an outfit for you? You'll see why. What, so you can make the palette? Please just pick out an outfit. Do not be guessing right now. Well, what am I supposed to be, uh... If you want, you can pick, like, a dress and some shoes. Or you okay. can do a shirt and some pants. A full outfit. A full outfit, huh? Yeah. Totally up to you. Here, I like this. Okay. So there's like a top dress thing. Now, what about shoes? Uh, is it a dress? Yeah, that's a dress. Okay. I mean, if you want, you can pick pants with it, but well, that's supposed to be a dress. So we got shoes over there. And if you really want, you could go crazy and pick a hat, but I don't think any of those would really go. I guess these would probably go best. This color with that. Okay. And that's the end of your, uh, your outfit, you think? Yeah, I don't think I have to go with that. And then from there, I can only use the colors in that outfit to do my makeup. I know, I am so excited. I don't even know why this popped into my head that one night, but I'm really glad it did because I think that this is going to be so much fun. All right, well, stay tuned if you want to find out what happens. This is not the look. I'm just telling you right now. This is just my makeup from throughout the day. So stay tuned to find out what the actual look is going to look like at the end. I am so super, super excited for this. And uh, yeah, let's just get right into it. Okay, so we have our chosen outfit. This is it today. We have our patterned dress right here. I dressed it up with some gold jewelry because my dad picked these wedges and they have gold on the belt. So this is what we are going to be going with today. We got some gold accents and then this, this dress. So yeah, this is it. This is our outfit for the day. Woohoo! Okay, so I am now back. I only did a couple things that are not very exciting to watch on camera. So I just did them off camera. I only did my foundation, concealer, and powder. And then I just put on some brows. I mean, my brows are pretty much filled in already. They're very thick. I'm very fortunate to have those kind of brows, so I figured no one would really want to watch me fill in my brows for five minutes, so we can get into the fun stuff here. So normally what I would do in my routine after I finish this kind of face base is bronzing my face. So we're going to move on to that. So I am going to start with my Shade and Light palette from Kat Von D. Love, love this palette so much. Um, and let's see, let's do a little comparison. So here is what I'm going off of, kind of. This is what I got for my face. And as you can see, there's a million different browns in here. In this shoe, there is a hundred. So I am very excited about that. And since we're going with the theme of brown, I thought contour would be very easy. So I'm just gonna pick up this middle shade right here. Let me get my brushes out. A girl is not prepared. <laughs> Okay, so now that I have my brushes out, because I'm really unprepared most of the time, I'm going to go in with this shade from 
the contour palette called Shadow Play. This is really the only one that I use. I have a feeling that today is going to be a very natural look. That's just my, my feeling. Oh! Okay, nose contour. I see you coming at me. I barely even put any powder there. It. I like it. Bronzed goddess moment. We love it. Okay, so now that I am bronzed, I think normally what I would do next is brighten my under eyes, which is something I do pretty much every day because as you can see, the bags, they're not really bad until I look down. Do you see? Whew, bitch, we never look down. We never look down. Okay, so I'm gonna take that same Kat Von D palette and I'm just gonna go in with this brightening shade right here, this banana powder. Love it so very much. And I'm just gonna take some of that on my beauty blender and just brighten up my face. Okay, we are brightened. We're ready for the next step. After I contour and all that good stuff, sometimes I do blush, sometimes I do eyeshadow. It kind of depends. I think today we're gonna move on to blush first. Now, I didn't really have a blush shade, really, that matches this at all. So I figured we can go in with an eyeshadow instead. Now, the only true maroon color that I have out of any of my eyeshadow palettes is Manny's collab with Makeup Geek. This guy right here, I'm gonna take this color, color, color right here, and I'm gonna attempt to use some blush on my face. So I'm just gonna lightly tap both sides first, and then we can blend this out. Oh, sh well, um, this was a bad idea. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go back in with that Kat Von D and I'm gonna take some more of that banana powder and I'm gonna layer it on top and see if that works. I mean, it's, it's all wrong, but at least it's there. Do you see, it's like not blending. This side is okay. No, it's not. <laughs> I'm lying to you. Okay, well, blush is done. And we look a little scary. But, we keep moving on. Next, I'm gonna do, we're gonna save highlight for later. So I think we should just move straight into eyeshadow. This, I think, should be the easy part. I think this is probably the easiest part of all of it. Well, we're going in with a shimmer, I guess, because since I have to use all the colors, the only thing I can think of to use white on is my eye, you know, to set my eye. I have no clue where else I would use white, so I think we're just gonna go in with Jaclyn's Armed and Gorgeous from the vault collection that I just reviewed last video, and I'm gonna go in with this guy, this VIP shade. Now, I think this next part will probably be a little bit easier, I'm assuming, but the first thing I wanna do is take some sort of transition shade. So, I think I'm gonna go in with the original Jaclyn palette from Morphe, and I'm gonna grab, whew, I'm gonna grab this more, more. <laughs> I'm gonna grab this Morphe R37, and I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. Alexa in the other room just went off. What the fuck? It's just weird layering a matte on top of a shimmer. It's very odd. I can honestly say that I've never done that before. Other than like to go back and like fix something, but never like a shimmer all over the lid. I'm going to go in with this guy right here called Mars. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Oh, I don't want to go in with the same brush. What am I doing? I'm going to go in with the Morphe 441. And I'm going to tuck this into my crease. 
that looks pink to me. Don't you think that looks pink? I don't know, maybe I'm just going crazy. Hey, what is that? Oh yeah. My fucking part of my eye that doesn't work. Where? 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 Okay, so we did our maroon, we did our white, and we've definitely used a bunch of tans. I think we should go in. Let's see. Oh, we can use gold. Oh my goodness, we can use gold. I'm actually gonna go in with this Armed and Gorgeous palette. So let's start by going in with this guy, coin, and then we will go from there. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that real quick. Oh! I'm kind of feeling like just like putting gold everywhere. I love this gold now. So I'm actually gonna go in on that same palette with coin. And I'm just gonna go right under my lash line. Okay, pretty. Um, I don't actually have any brown eyeliner, so we're gonna skip eyeliner today. And I do have brown mascara, actually. So we're gonna go in with that. This is the Tarte Lifted Waterproof Mascara. This was actually in my Ipsy 2, and I kinda like this. So we're gonna go with it. Let's grab a mirror, and I'm just gonna do the use, apply this to my lashes. I'm literally going to McDonald's after this. I'll just have you know. I'm gonna walk in, and they're gonna be like, who the f do you think you are? And I'm gonna be like, um, a basic bitch? Yeah, I know. Thank you. Of course, Champagne Pop changed the game, girl. I absolutely love this highlight. So I'm gonna grab some. It is on my chair, on my floor on my dress this is just not my day and we're still gonna use it because we are dedicated people and I literally don't have any other gold highlight I know I sound insane but I don't I have silver okay please work Okay, it still works, bitch. Okay, I found the lip that I'm gonna use. I'm gonna go in with this one. This is Jeffree Star's Christmas Cookie. This is a very tan nude, and I think it looks really good on me. It's one of my favorite colors, so I think, I think that's gonna happen today. And I'm actually gonna go in the center with this color, which is I'm Nude. Also from Jeffree Star. And I think we are pretty much done with this look. So what do we think? What do we think? Okay, that is it for this video. I just finished up the lip, which is the last step of this entire makeup look. And I honestly think it came out pretty good. I am loving it. I am very excited. I actually really like the eye look with the gold. This color scheme was actually pretty, pretty interesting to put together and I really didn't think I'd ever try anything like this and I definitely encourage everybody else to try it because it is a lot of fun. So if you do like this idea, please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe because I will be putting out content I have decided Wednesdays and Sundays, girl, are when I'm gonna be putting out this content from now on so you can look out for that i'll see you on wednesday